Today we had a simulated disaster drill involving a mass casualty pedestrian struck by motor vehicle accident. And this was our very first collaborative event where we had physical therapy and the nursing uh, department work together. We do disaster drill every semester, once in the spring, once in the fall. But the reason that these are so important to them is because it's that authentic, high fidelity uh, learning experience that they're not going to get in other places outside of SIM. And we had makeup put on to make us all bloodied up and uh, where we were given cards to say like what our injuries were so that when the provider came to us that we would be able to act out to them what was going on. Our students take a emergency medical management class in the summer between years one and two. And in our training we get a lot of single patient experiences so it was really interesting to take that and then apply it to multiple patients. Um, kind of like going with the most critically wounded and then working your way to the, the less critically wounded. I want to work in the ER actually so I think this is going to be an amazing way for me to know what I'm getting or when they're tagged when they come in like I'll know what to do and how to assess them afterwards. It was a good experience to be a patient first so that it kind of has me like primed for the course and then eventually with the simulation and hopefully that if I ever unfortunately had to be involved in a situation that we would be ready. There were a lot of challenges but it's really good to be able to look back on those and kind of make improvements. I, mean, I think communication was one of the bigger things that we had troubles with like talking to all the people involved in the scenario. But specifically with the nursing students, I thought it was like pretty good communication and um, it was definitely a good professional development opportunity.